What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel Critical Overlord here. So this will be the recap for Pre Lies Original Sin Episode 6. Episode 6 starts with Tabby admitting to what happened at the bonfire party. She was invited while at her job and asked Chip to cover for her. Tabby gets too drunk and gets lightheaded at the party. She ends up walking into the woods away from everyone else and ends up on the ground. Next thing she knew someone was on, someone was on top of her but she doesn't know who it was that assaulted her. Imogen asks if she told her mom. Tabby says Imogen is the first person she's told. Imogen expresses her secret to Tabby and they both hug each other. Imogen asks Tabby to join her in meeting this source that might have some answers for them. We then jump to Monday. Farron is shown in her ballet course asking Miss Clark for assistance on her attire. Farron talks to Kelly and says she was out of line and Kelly says the only reason Farron is still here is because she asked the teacher to keep her. Minnie is then shown chatting with Ash in the hallways and Ash asks her out for bowling. Minnie agrees and gets excited. Noah meets with her coach who tells her there's an open spot due to an injury. Noah declines but says she's available for, for the spring semester. Farron's mom, Corey, gets a note from A saying some scars you see but some you don't but they all hurt. There's a gun with the box as well. And then... We are shown a quick flashback to 1999 with Corey getting a tattoo with Angela. We are then jumping back to Farron has a scene discussing her scoliosis. Farron has a scene discussing her scoliosis before she heads home to prepare for Corey's arrival. Imogen and Tabby are shown meeting up with Joseph who prefers to be called Crazy Joe. <laughs> Joe admits to being in love with Angela Waters and says that they were friends. This lasted until their mom stole her from him. After Angela's poor treatment led to her demise on Y2K night, uh, Rose, who is Angela's mom, came to school with a butcher knife seeking revenge. Rose was then taken to Radley Sanitarium in Rosewood and Imogen asked if she's still there. Tabby and Imogen plan to go to Rosewood to see Rose Waters. Kelly and Greg make out on stage before Kelly tells him to stop. Kelly says if he wants a chance, he better be at Swan Lake with Roses. The masked figure is seen watching from the background while this happens. We then jump to Noel who tells her boyfriend Sean that her mom got fired from the hospital for stealing drugs. She says she needs to be present for her mom and couldn't do sports as a result of this. Minnie is shown video chatting with Steve telling him he only gets one encounter. Noah talks to the school nurse about her mom and she says she'll try to help. Imogen meets with the other liars to talk about Angela's mom being in Radley. Tabby says if they can figure out what happened between Angela and their moms then they could find out who way is possibly noah tells her mom that she can get her job back if she goes to rehab for 30 days noah's mom agrees to go after some convincing tabby is then shown doing a swan lake performance imogen and tabby go to the ratley hotel in rosewood and they try to gather info about the sanitarium before it was a hotel jeff at the front desk say they can speak to eddie lamb but he won't be until tomorrow Imogen books them a room and they enjoy themselves while there. Sean confronts Noah's mom and asks if she knows how bad she's ruining her daughter's life. He says to stop dragging her down before it's too late. Farron and her parents have a dinner to celebrate the Swan Lake performance. She has an appointment in the morning for surgery. Imogen and Tabby are still relaxing in their hotel room. Tabby goes to explore Rosewood. Minnie has fun on her bowling date with Ash. Steve is there stalking Minnie and introduces himself as Minnie's dad to both of them after uh, after Ash spots them. Noah has an argument with her mom over Sean's visit earlier. She tells Noah she got a job at Pinball Pizza and Noah doesn't need to worry about her anymore. Tabby is shown wandering Rosewood before going to the bookstore and meeting with a boy she eventually kisses, although this is all in her head because she rejects the boy in the real world. Kelly gets a text from A saying Jelly, saying, saying Kelly or Karen before someone attacks her and chases her in the auditorium. She ends up cornered and cries that she's Kelly before the person leaves. Imogen talks to Tabby and says they have a meeting with Eddie tomorrow. Farron backs out of the surgery and argues with her mom because she thinks her mom doesn't think she's beautiful or has a problem with Farron's body. Eddie Lamb says the girl's mom came to visit Rose Waters on multiple occasions. Eddie reveals that Angela was, was assaulted as well prior to her death. At school, Farron receives some documents in her locker related to her health history. Farron is informed that Kelly has backed out of the play. Tabby notices a sixth person was visiting Rose along with her moms. Imogen admits she was assaulted as well, and that's how she ended up getting pregnant. Uh, we then end with Noah's mom being shown meeting with a drug dealer on her break. Everyone arrives for the Swan Lake play. 
Noah tells her coach she wants to join the team. Minnie spots Steve walking her or stalking her in the crowd at, at uh, Farron's play. After the play, though, Farron learns her mom was in a very bad accident because her dad shows up afterward or sometime after the play and says they need to go because her mom has been in a terrible accident. Now, I really enjoyed episode six. You are, again, you have better, you have those answers coming back at you, right? Back to back to back. They're not dragging certain things out, which I do like, but it's just like in the finale, certain placement of things, they don't get to breathe. That's the pacing they have to work on with how they want to address all these issues. They have to work on that. But I'm glad, you know, now you know who, or what not who you know what has happened to tabby and imogen you know what i was talking about in my spoiler free review for episode six through ten about what they share as a secret together and they will address who did this to both uh it could have been two different individuals it might have been the same individual and you will find out who imogen's baby father was of course because again she confessed to being assaulted and she also stated that that's how she ended up pregnant Next week, you guys will find out again who A is. You'll find out more about Angela Waters. Get some answers on that. Find out what is actually going on. Uh, I will say that if you want to, try to pay attention to a lot of things in certain locations of episode one. I don't want to give too many, too many hints. There's certain stuff you should pay attention to and certain bits of dialogue from certain characters that will help you understand why they end up being A when you see episodes 8 through 10 next week because when you rewatch the show i've done it there's so many clues pointing to this person and i'm like wow i don't know how i overlooked it but it's also got the a reveal is going to have another twist along with it so it's not going to be that easy again i'm not trying to give a lot away but i would say rewatch and pay attention to certain things that might be hanging up on the walls or certain bits of dialogue from other characters or certain things that relate to the ballet and other aspects of certain things that you'll notice as you rewatch when a is revealed but let me know what you guys think about this recap down in the comment section below what did you think about episode six if you haven't already of course make sure you subscribe turn on post notification and you haven't missed a video in the description i have links to my social media accounts on facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course let me know any movies news or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video